Barack Obama telling us we need to vote for this black um, Indian lady, right? I'm confused. Black Indian, black Indian, black Indian. Is he black and Indian? Or is, is this uh, her father half Indian? Her her father is half uh, Jamaican, and her mom I don't I don't know. I know that she got a black white. Uh, she got a white husband. She don't like black men. She got white. She got a white husband, white family, doing um, white shit. Is her white husband is not sagging pants and shit? You know she know that her white husband is not sagging pants and shit, right? Her white husband got a suit on and um got his shirt tucked in. But she act like she like dudes that sag and shit. Uh, all bitch ass motherfuckers back here that be selling dope and shit. I'll, I'll be always seeing them busy and shit. Back here where I park my green car. We gotta get out of this house because the flood, water damage. So let me let me get let me get started today. Okay. All right. Now white cops be. All right, now first of all, the chicks be in the house slapping us and shit. And I don't know where it starts from, to be honest. Okay. I be hearing, ooh, well, 1980 was the last time it was real niggas. Real niggas used to check the woman and then this. No, 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 no. My mom is 64. She respect men. She, res she respect men. She count on men. She don't take their car to a white mechanic and do this shit. She respect, she... She asked me to fix her car and all that. So it used to be to where the women respect men. But if the if the if our women don't respect us, and she she's able to get the state and she's able to get us uh killed by the police over some lying shit, that's when we leave the house. Especially if she already has kids and shit. It's already all this shit's already set up. By the time I'm able, five feet six tall me is able to get a check. She's already old, 40. I mean, by the time she ready to sit down, she's older, 40, five feet. That's when five feet, six tall me is able to get with her. Just, just to let you know, when she was 20s and shit, she was fucking all the thugs and all the tall dudes and all the other motherfuckers that be leaving her and shit. And then all that, that hate built up about uh, them leaving them and all that. So let me set that straight. So how can I walk in the fucking house with all these chicks with all these kids? You keep talking about 1981 was the last time it was real niggas. I'm, I'm not, I'm not, first of all, I don't have to date a chick with kids. It was real niggas back then because the cops, I mean, we, we was able to beat them and shit when they get out of line. Now we, now we can't even, now we get accused for beating them and the cops shoot us. So that started increasing. Dope deal started, corn started happening once we left the house. Because it's sex and eight and shit. The man is not allowed to be in the house or nothing. So we left the fucking house and we, uh, our women decided to use the check and use the state and, uh, and think that this is cool. Oh, I'm in my 20s. I get to wear short shorts on. I get to um, get free money, free EBT, and I don't have to work. I'm sorry, but I'm, I'm not about to, I'm not doing that. These white cops need to stay the fuck out of business. Then we could, then I can do that. Then I can slap our, slap the bitch when, um, like we used to do in 1980, I guess. I don't know. Uh, old ass. But the cops, I mean, we, we, we let the chick slap us in the house, to be honest. We let the chick slap us nowadays, nowadays. It's 2024 now. I'm on my kids these days. But the bitch called the police on us and say that we hit her. And the police show up crazy. Bomb rushing, about to shoot us so close to shoot us, even shoot us probably. Thinking that we always be hitting her, and um, which need to happen. So they build all that and believe in all women and shit. But when when the chicks steal from Target and all that shit, they be like, oh, well, it's just a black woman, one of those ones that that be the victims. And then they end up getting slapped, and then they end up getting um lied on. The cops end up getting lied on and losing their job. Haha, <laughs> that's what you get for not believing us when, when, when we get slapped to shit in the damn house and, and we get accused of beating. So that's where I'm at. I don't give a fuck with how 1980, my parents met in 1976 and was together until my dad passed in 2019. My foster parents was born in the 30s. They was married, they got a job and all that. Anyways, our women is out of control, but we're not in the household.
We do know that, right? All this happened because we started leaving the house because women stopped respecting us. You can y'all stop saying that it used to be real niggas checking the women. Also used to be women who respect men. My mom still respect men. They don't call them white folks to fix their car and say, she, she called me because she count on men. The other motherfuckers, I don't need a man. <laughs> Already got 90 kids before I can get in and danger and all that. I'm not about to slap her and get, and get killed by the police. What you doing? I should slap you for, uh, for having all these kids. Now, kill these kids. Oh, no, boy, I get the death penalty for doing that, cursing that. Force her to do that. These days, no. And then a Barack Obama is telling us, I vote for this, I mean, I voted for this bitch-ass nigga twice. First time I voted for him, um, I was barely old enough to vote. I was 19. My parents were telling me, vote straight Democrat, circle, straight Democrat, straight Democrat. And I was circle Democrat, Democrat names, and then... My mom, my, uh, my dad smiled to my mom. He voted for it, so and so. I was voting for mayors, and it was different mayors, not just president. So we left the house, and everything turned to shit. And then you gonna tell us to vote for a bitch that used to put us in jail for no reason? And um, while she's dating, not dating, while she's married to a white dude with a suit on. Which probably indicates she don't like black men. Ooh, black men need to vote for her. The one that she won't even give white people money. She won't even give she, the FEMA. They won't give anybody. FEMA won't give nobody shit. Anybody shit. But they want to give illegal immigrants thirty thousand dollars and a house and EBT and everything. They got it going on. But men is men mind is not right. I get killed a knee in my neck for saying, come on now, please don't kill me. I'm not the type of guy. But the way we be, oh, you bitch ass cop. Same thing that be happening in the fucking house. Bitch ass nigga. It be happening to y'all cops. We had to detain them for stealing from Walmart shit. Oh, now you want to believe them. I mean, now you want to believe us. I, I, just, I ain't got time for that. And the chicks that vote for only vote for uh, to increase the fortune and get free money. And all you have to do is get a part-time job. But they losing their house. Hold these bitches still more for your store.